Nomzi Skaji has been living in this muddy structure since 1990. She says she's been subjected to poor remuneration and appalling working conditions. She hopes the visit by parliamentarians will improve her living conditions. She says they just want them to live under these conditions and if you complain, you'll be fired. You just have to accept whatever you get paid. The portfolio committees believe efforts should be enhanced to clamp down on farmers who are ill-treating their workers. It's quite sad. We are saying this with a with very heavy hearts that really uh, there are still people that are living in conditions that you also see. There are still people that are being uh, treated by their employer, in, uh, as as we have seen in other areas. <laughs> and they are there is one I'm not going to say where. A manager of a farmer who told us in a straight, straight face that we prefer to employ Zimbabweans than South Africans. And when we asked that, why? He said it's because there are no people here who can work. To them what is important is that uh, 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 South Africans, that's what we are assuming, South Africans are lazy, they are going to delay their profit, but that is a reflection that this sector is still a sector that is lacking behind in terms of transformation. The next stop for the committees will be the Limpopo province. Abongile Yankees, SABC News, Stetterheim.